Good evening from New York, a city that is trying to begin to recover from the wildest media circus of the year. Steps away from this studio only four hours ago in a Sheraton hotel in Midtown Manhattan. Thank you very much for being here. I'd like to take this time to address some questions that have come up over the past few days. I take full responsibility for my actions. I have made some mistakes that have hurt the people that I care about the most. And for that, I am deeply sorry. Last Friday night, I tweeted a photo of myself as a joke to a follower. Once I realized I hadn't DM'd it, but had accidentally posted it to my live page, I panicked. I took it down and announced that I had been hacked. It was a hugely regrettable mistake. I am deeply sorry for the trouble this has caused Jenny Decker and Cat Nove and their run for the White House. But my actions should in no way reflect poorly upon them. I am deeply ashamed of my actions, America, but I will not resign. In addition, I have engaged in several inappropriate conversations that I now regret over Twitter, Facebook, email, on the phone and Skype. Over the past year, I've exchanged explicit photos with approximately five men, three women, and a transvestite. For the most part, these communications took place before my marriage, though sadly some have occurred after. First question. Go. Well, obviously, what I did after my marriage was inappropriate. But what I did before was nobody's damn business. Next question. Clearly, I wasn't thinking, but I've never actually met any of these men, women, all the transvestite, and had no physical contact whatsoever. I want that on the record. I did not have sexual relations with that transvestite. Andrew Breitbart himself showed up and seized the microphone and announced that he has a much more graphic photograph than any we have seen, and he explained why he has not released that photograph. You know what I would be accused of if I, if I released this photo? I'm not doing this for nefarious purposes. I'd like an apology. And so I'm here for some vindication. I'm trying to do the decent thing here. Andrew Breitbart was standing where you're standing not more than 20 minutes ago and claimed that he had an X-rated photo of you. Do you have anything to say to Andrew Breitbart? Andrew Breitbart is an unhinged man. He is not a journalist. He is so enamored with himself and his factless file that he spews out to America. The man's more excited about looking around to make sure which camera is on him. That's all he cares about, America. That's all he cares about. I will not resign. I will not resign. That'll be all.